What a perfect day for football we've got here. Martin Tyler here with Alan Smith. Bundesliga action is on our menu today. It's Union Berlin against Mainz. Yeah, thanks, Martin. Looking forward to this. We've got some really good players out there, and importantly, we've got some match winners, some goal scorers down on that pitch. And I don't think we'll be disappointed. Could be his game today, the way he's been playing recently. Three in his last three. Really been his team's man of the moment. So this is how the hosts line up today. Well, three at the back. That's the first thing that catches the eye. What about the rest of the team? Well, it looks to be a 3-4-3. Three, three. You certainly don't see it that often. And when it works, it can catch the opposition off guard, really. It can be a really awkward shape to contend with. Mainz and their lineup, and it's interesting they've got three at the back and three up front. It's quite an unusual formation, isn't it? You don't often see it. It's going to be interesting to see how it pans out here. But uh, I think the manager has got an option to switch. Maybe go back to uh, four at the back if he wants to. Oh, this is always the great moment. The ball's on the centre spot and we're all ready to go. Another turnover in play here with that interception. Room now out of the wing. Try behind the defenders to get in a good cross. Well, it is a chance to relieve some of the pressure here by simply having the ball and it's gone out of play there anticipated the direction of the pass and was able to intervene solidly away Yunus Malik Encouraging play from this team now, keeping the ball. It's good play to uh, get a foot in and intercept. Daniel Brzezinski. Robin Quaison. Adam Shalai. Keeping the ball and looking for an opening. Quaison. Flag up for offside, it's not going to count. Well, really good organisation from the defence, and it was offside looking at it. Well, we can see it again, Alan. Well, it's so difficult, these decisions by the assistants, but I think he's got that one right, well played. they want to get out of this position where they're just defending their own penalty area really and play more active in the game gets his cross in and safe hands from the goalkeeper there not the most demanding save but it had to be made easy though to take it a little easy take your eye off the ball he screened the ball well there Coming into the penalty area now. Quick on. He could take them on here. That's great defending there, stopping that attack. And that header takes the ball out of play. Friedrich. Friedrich. 
Supertic. Robin Quaison taking on the opposition and the responsibility as well. Patient play as they... Salai! Oh, we hit it well enough. Uh, but as we can see, nowhere near the goal. Yeah, and his teammates aren't overly impressed with that. Maybe took his eye off the ball. Taking on a couple of opponents now. Guiding the pass through. Throw in now. Trying to pick out someone in the centre. The man in the middle's got there. And he's seen the shot. And that's a, a save for the goalkeeper. Now, the manager's been getting into them on that touchline. They seem a little lackadaisical out there. Certainly not as uh, creative as they normally are. Must be a goal! He got in the way. On the front foot now, they've got a corner, hoping for the goal that will put them in the lead. And they catch the opposition out with this short corner. He's chosen to cut it back now. Good distance to the clearance then. Being pressed, uh, defensive area. Well, two more minutes to play, that of added time. So easy in possession. Going forward with real purpose now. A well, space to get the cross in. Got his foot in to cut out the pass. So it's half-time and we're still waiting for that first goal. Well, the word average comes to mind about his first half. What do you think, Alan? Well, let's face it, he hasn't played particularly well. It's been poor so far and his team needs him in this second half. Tough test this for the players in the second half and the referee as well who might have a big decision to make. At the moment he says we can play on, but that might be in doubt as the second half wears on. Now a chance to get a bit of width into this attack. Danny Latza. Trying to find Shalai. Trying to cross it and in the end a bit of a waste I think. Well, the wide man can show his skills here. A chance to whip it in here. Strange game at the moment, the attacking team having all the ball, but not really making many chances because the opposition are defending in numbers. It's Anderson. Yunus Mali. Can he finish? He's almost defied gravity to get to that one. Full stretch, it was heading for the corner, that one. In goes the corner. Disappointed that that didn't lead to more. Trying to find the opening, which would be so crucial. Christopher Trimmel. Now Yunus Mali. That's good passing, probing. And that's what the coach would want, to stop the supply into the middle. Got his body in front of the opponent and protected the ball well. Looking to widen the play, really, widen the build-up, but the ball's just run straight out over the touchline. We've got substitutes warming up for 
both sides and both managers are going to bring on some fresh legs Gentner now Yunus Mali we see a substitute coming on for the away team here oh, he spotted the pass and cut it out maybe took his eye off the ball Read that well with the interception. They can be quick on the break now. Quaison, Danny Ladza. Robin Quaison. This does look promising. Certainly playing well enough to get their noses in front here. He's got it away. Jeffrey Brumer. Danny Latza, Levin Ustuna. Oh, an important interception that. Well, we did get a weather forecast that seemed to suggest that it would just be showers, but this looks so it's set in and it's heavy. Yeah, no surprise that the old forecasts are wrong. How many times have we seen that? And it will be their throw. Now, they do need an injection of uh, fresh enthusiasm from the bench. Danny Latza. That's an inspired interception. At a really crucial moment, that might just decide the match. A couple of teammates up in support. Richly deserved opening goal. A match that looked as though it might end frustratingly for them. But they have been the better side throughout. And now they've got what they really have pushed for throughout, right from the first whistle. They've been the side that has attacked, that wanted to win the game, and they should go on and win it from here. Oh, it's smooth as silk, that move, and what a cross in from that wide. And that has opened the scoring, 1-0 here. Keep an eye on the watch, because we haven't got that long to go. And the team know that. They can't get too desperate, though. They need to keep some sort of poise about their play. Yeah, they've got to keep the shape. I mean, it's not time to further centre-half and the goalkeeper forward yet, but we're approaching that moment. Referee has blown, and he's given the free kick. He's not going to go for goal, is he? He's an awfully long way out. The uh, attack has fizzled out here. Goal kick. Wonderful group of fans, these. It's a great occasion for them, and they're determined to make the most of it. Yeah, and I think if their team wins today, they will have a big part to play in it. They've got behind them. They've not always played well. The side hasn't, but the fans haven't wilted in their support. Here we are with just three minutes remaining. Saw the direction of the pass. And the decision for the added time is three minutes. Danny Latza. Bit of space to go forward into with the ball. Well, they are 
really knocking the ball around well. Yeah, there's always been an option for the... That's the final whistle from the referee. This is a team that sets out to win every game, and I suppose every now and then something like this is going to come along, you underachieve, you underperform. Well, that's right, if you're not properly at it, if it's not 100% performance, you, you will be made to pay quite often, and that was the case here.